a uh, young STEM leader is someone that kind of motivates the younger people that want to do what we're doing and show them how we've done it ourselves. Today, I'll, today we'll be doing leading a microscope session, so we'll be showing them how microscope works, each of the parts of the microscope and every bit, that, like how it's used in the modern day world as well. Sometimes I think a misconception is that you think you have to be really academic to get into STEM, but the fact is uh, you really don't, you just have to be creative and I think our job is sort of to lead them to the kind of thing that will get that going and uh, make them successful in it. I got asked to reinvigorate the STEM club here and then we became of the, the Way of the Young STEM Leader programme from Cirque and really wanted to get involved with that because I see it as an excellent way of being able to measure the outcomes for those, those young, young students and being able to give them something really concrete to show about all their effort and reward that effort that they put in. As a young STEM leader we compete in competitions and we also get girls and young people involved in STEM. We did a day of physics where we got girls around Scotland to come to our school and we did workshops through the day and we just kind of encouraged them to get involved in how many different areas there is that we can get involved in. I think creativity is probably one of the main ones that I've developed as a young STEM leader. I've improved my teamwork skills a lot by beforehand I found it quite hard to speak to other people and be involved with projects and this has helped me a lot. It's a group and a lot of groups can give you skills and stuff but I think STEM has absolutely like changed me as a person, it's given me more skills. I think it's a great idea to get involved with the Young STEM Leader project and um, firstly it's free, um, it is accredited so you get your SQA, SDQF points, you get your insight points. I'd previously had experience um, as a marker for SQA and I found those skills have been transferable. Uh, we run it with our pupils in the ASM base at level two um, and then we also have a group of six year pupils who are working in the programme at level six become like a family. Having STEM as kind of a new social group, you get to make friends, you get to have new experiences with people and it's enjoyable. It's a great thing for your future as well. It helps CVs help you get into universities. It's just a great thing for people to see that you gain the skills from this if you take it into your, your future. A lot of kids in the, in the younger years who are really enthusiastic and also really good at it. So hopefully after we leave, uh, we'll have helped them just that little bit to keep going and do their own thing. The thing about the Young STEM Leader Programme is it gives us this really good, constructive, uh, well-developed framework so the students can see what they're aiming for. And it's their own individual log, it's that structure that I really like. I've enjoyed it so much um, and the, the support as well from CERC is fantastic. So once you join, you join a family um, of people who will help you to deliver the award.